Hello, my name is uh, Dave Presack. I'm a Systems Application Manager for Texas Instruments. I'm here with Tom Catalano from Critical Link, and we're here to talk about the, uh, the new sensor awareness demo we've put together. It showcases three different forms of uh, AFEs, the 1248s, the 1259, and the 1232, uh, programmed and configured for temperature, for pressure, and for uh, weight scale interface. All this is interfacing to a mighty DSP uh, control platform, and Tom will tell you a little about that. Thank you, Dave. Uh, what we're doing is we're, we're bringing all of the analog sensor inputs into the Mighty DSP platform. The Mighty DSP is a small system on a module based on TI's OMAP L138 processor. The OMAP L138, if you're not familiar with it, contains both a DSP and an ARM on the chip. So we're bringing all the data into uh, from the data converters into the DSP, processing the data there, as well as doing stepper motor control in the DSP passing uh, resultant data up to the ARM, where the ARM is doing all of the uh, user interface and display. The system on a module is available in an off-the-shelf platform that helps customers get their products to market much more quickly and cheaper, and information can be found at MightyDSP.com. That's M-I-T-Y-D-S-P.com. So now let's look at the actual components of the demo. There are four different segments from, from TI. The first is the ADS-1248. This has the actual uh, constant voltage or constant current depending on which uh, temperature method you're using. This is use, using a, a thermocouple, so in this case it's a constant voltage output, thermocouple input. The second is the uh, ADS-1259. This is being used with an instrumentation amp, an OPA-309, to do an interface to a pressure sensor, and I'll show you how that works a little bit. The third element is the ADS-1232. This one is connected to the weigh scale. This is doing a very precise uh, small changes in weight on the, uh, on the weigh scale. And the fourth in the far back is the DRV-8412. This is a stepper motor driver, uh, including with the kit, if you ever order it, comes with an actual stepper motor that's used here in the demo. Tom? So this is all being driven and used by the Mighty DSP platform. This is a platform that is available as a development kit from Critical Link. The development kit features the system on modules from Critical Link. Uh, the one we're using in this demonstration is this one right here, the Mighty DSP-L138F, again based on the OMAP L138 processor from TI. It also features an, uh, a Xilinx Spartan 6 FPGA. Uh, we also have a system on a module that is uh, pin for pin compatible that if you do not need an FPGA um, is, is uh, available in a form factor that is a little bit smaller, pin for pin compatible with the OMAP L138 and no FPGA. Now what we're doing here in this demo is, is interfacing to each of the components that, that Dave just talked about. The uh, data is all being collected on the DSP as mentioned earlier. All of the stepper motor control is being done in the DSP itself, including uh, low-level control of each of the coils in the, in the stepper motor itself. So that's what, what value the DSP is bringing. It is communicating over DSP link uh, in real time to the ARM, and the ARM is, is featuring this display here. We're running a QT graphics framework um, that is uh, open source and freely available to develop with and uh, using some QT widgets in order to show temperature, pressure, and weight. Now, uh, what we'd like to do is just kind of quickly run through the demo and show you how the, uh, how the demo operates. First, we put a weight on the belt. Hopefully, we pick the, the weight that's going to uh, be the proper weight uh, when we get to the end. So first, we, uh, we put our fingers here on the thermocouple in order to get the temperature up into the uh, target range, which is anywhere from 90 to 95 degrees. Get up there, and we have to stay there for a couple of seconds. Okay, we've made it. Now we're driving the motor left. Now we move on to the pressure part of the demo. So we're going to try and get the uh, pressure into the green range again on the gauge. And hopefully get it there and keep it there. Try to make it a game to make it a little bit tricky. Keep it in the range seconds and got it. Now we're going to take the, the weight and drop it onto the load cell and hopefully we pick the right weight. We're in the right range and we win. So that's the sensor demo. I want to thank Tom for his time. 
Again, uh, my name is Dave Presack with Texas Instruments. You can find information on all the TI components at ti.com. And Tom Catalino, thank you, Dave. Uh, with Critical Link, you can find all of our information about our system on modules and our, our company at criticallink.com or mightydsp.com, M-I-T-Y-D-S-P.com. Thank, thank you. you.